And new tonight, 20 dogs are recovering after a weekend fire at a Lawrence kennel. Look at this picture showing tireless work by firefighters and witnesses. They and a recent donation to the Lawrence Fire Department are being credited with saving these dogs. KBC 9's Eli Rosenberg has the story. It was gut wrenching, but you could, there was nothing you could do at the time. I opened the kennel door and you could just smell the fumes, and the dogs were like not responsive. I, I don't want to go into detail. It didn't look good at first, as Lawrence firefighters, teachers from a nearby jazzercise class, and others tried to save 22 dogs after an early morning fire at Crystal Canine. As soon as they two men drop one kennel and then two more would drop and they were running back and forth. We knew we had them, we knew how to use them. So Just last month, the fire department received several specialized dog oxygen masks. Like I said, this is Rescue 5 and it's right here. A donation from the Chinese Sharpei Club of America. These masks uh, fit over the snout. The perfect fit at just the right time. Many of the dogs at this kennel had been dropped off as people went out of town for Thanksgiving. You know, I saw several, you know, guys really just giving everything they had to try to get these dogs roused. A timely donation and firefighters who refused to quit, saving 21 dogs and giving plenty of owners another reason to say thanks. It was a total miracle of God that, that they had the mask. In Lawrence, Eli Rosenberg. KMBC 9 News. And a director of the Chinese Sharpei Club of America tells us he's thrilled to hear the organization's donation was able to help. Investigators say the fire at the kennel started after a fan malfunction. But that's really good news that all those pups are good and hopefully going home soon. Another reason to be thankful. That's right.